Hi. <laughs> Just me, psycho girl, being a weirdo. How you doing? Welcome to episode 14 on strawberry ice cream. Builder boy and psycho girl save the land. So much is happening. We finally found villager 23. He was such a weirdo. He decided to stay underground. We left some torches and lit the way back up to above ground if he chooses to join us. He did give us a vital piece of information, a really babyish message from Lord Chuckles saying, we, you can't beat me, psycho girl. Whatever, whatever, Lord Chuckles, wherever you are, I'm gonna find you and kill you. And kill you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see who's chuckling then. Remember, I'm psycho, psycho, psycho. I may have lost my memory, but along with losing my memory, I've also lost my mind. But that's always been the case, right? So right now, Builder Boy and I are just, when we found that villager, we found a whole spawn of zombies. That was crazy. We were really lucky to be underground. We were able to build a wall where we could battle them from the other side. Otherwise, I don't know how successful we would have been. So for as unlucky as we've been, we also do have luck on our side. Things are looking up. We're gonna continue to build the storage space and work on my PVP skills. Let's go see what the day has in store for us. Psycho girl, are you awake? Hey, Builder Boy, come in. Just brushing my teeth. Hey, hey. Psycho girl. How's it going? <sighs> Minty fresh. Ooh, what kind of toothpaste <laughs> are you using? I use Tom's of Maine. It's, you know, not for everyone, but those who like it love it. Okay, okay. Spearmint. What do you use? Uh, Crest. <laughs> okay. <laughs> classic, classic. It's classic, yeah. You know, I'm not surprised you use Crest. You're pretty, uh, you're a traditionalist, it seems. <laughs> yep. So yesterday I was showing you a few of the minor changes we made inside um, uh, the room here. Um, but I wanted to show you a couple things that we've got that I think will really help spruce it up. So uh, first off, we've got, let me see here. I'm going to make this top one right here. I'm gonna add all the enchanted books in there. Ooh. Ooh. And I'm gonna put right below or right beside it some of the diamond stuff that we had. And then uh, over here, uh, so you can see I think you just really like opening up storage bins. <laughs> it's <my laughs> it's almost it sounds like a song. So over here we've got some item frames. Um, which are really, really cool. Um, we can actually use the item frames to create um, kind of like a way to know what's going to be in the loot box. So let me show, what it, show you what I mean. But let's say uh, this top one right here is for iron stuff. Uh, okay. So what we want to do is put an item frame right above it. And then what we can do is add a piece of iron right into the item frame, and then now we know that this box has got iron. Oh, okay, so that's like instead of a sign, it's like a picture sign. Yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. We cool, might, I like that. We might <coughs> really excuse want to- Excuse me. <laughs> excuse <laughs> you. I think I have some allergies. Whew. Hopefully there's no monsters around here that I'm allergic to. Yeah. Um, so what I'm thinking is we might actually want to move this storage container up one and same with this one that way we can have an item frame above each one. Oh, nice that's so much more organized i was having trouble remembering where everything went before <laughs> that alphabetical thing was not working for me yeah no i i think this will be a lot easier and really help us out yeah totally totes all right so what we need is one more piece of iron that we'll put right oops Get up I'm there. the king of the world! I'm the queen of the world! <laughs> Sorry, I, I get a little distracted. And a piece of gold. I think I need to dance. I need to, I need to do something fun. We need a party. No? No takers? <laughs> I want to see you dance. So how's that looking? It looks pretty cool. Now we can see that we've got uh, silver to the left and gold to the right. So much better. What goes in these again? Uh, so on the left, we've got, uh, it's kind of a mixture of different things. So it's like, I think it's a lot of like decorations. So maybe- Yeah, like it's a lot flower. of plants, plants and seeds and 
you know. Yeah, maybe we put a flower like that. And then. That's cutesy. And then over here we've got, uh, it looks like a bunch of food. So food. We, so maybe we put a food <laughs> in the item frame. What kind of food are you thinking? Mm, I think a turkey leg. A turkey leg? Uh, like a chicken? Yeah, chicken leg. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, let's do that. Um, bam, chicken. Mmm, smells good. All right, so... Get me out of here. I'm on a diet. <laughs> Okay. So now we need to figure out where to put the item frames for the double wooden chest. Do we put like two? What do you think? Or do we just put one and it's only on one side? Well, what are the double chests? Why do we have double? Is there just more stuff in there? Yeah, like for wood, we've got a lot of wood. So we're gonna need a lot of room for wood. Same thing with stone over here. We've got a lot of stone, so we're gonna need a lot of stone. Whatever we put on one, I think we should put on the other, just so it's the same. There's not too much going on. Okay. Should we maybe stick with just the single chests for now? See I mean, if there's enough room in them, then I guess so. Yeah. I mean, let's see what that could look like. Um, oh. Um, okay. So what we could do is instead of it just being all the wood in one chest, it could be... Um, all the different kinds of wood in all the different chests, if that makes sense. So, yeah, so one chest is birch, one chest is spruce. Yeah, I think that would look really good. Yes, I think that would be a lot more streamlined. Okay, let's try that. Um, so let's see here. Then we would add a chest like that, a chest like that, and just go like that. Now the problem is we got so much stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna dump, oops. I'm gonna dump all my stuff into one chest over here just so that I can clear my inventory and make sure that I'm putting everything away correctly. All right, so should we go from maybe like darkest to lightest wood? Yes, 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 I love that idea. Jean, like gorgeous. I love it. That looks pretty cool. That looks great. All right, now we just need to actually organize it. <laughs> so right. We got dark oak wood, which we actually don't have a whole lot of. Uh, so I'm going to take out the oak wood planks because we've got a lot of oak wood. Uh, that's like, I think, the most common type of wood that we have. What's that looking? That looks pretty cool. Shall I start grabbing stuff? Yeah. If we can just start placing them where they need to go, then I think we'll be good. Oak fence. Let me get back here and get a good view. Oh, yes. That looks great. That looks pretty looks cool, great. right? Looks pretty great. Yeah. And then, of course, we'll add one more here, one more there, and one more there. And then I think we actually need to make a few more chests. I think it's coming along pretty good. Now we're gonna be way more organized, which I think is gonna help us out so much. Totally. This looks really nice. I mean, even though it's still all wood and there's no color in this in here yet, it looks amazing. I can tell you're an experienced builder. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, I'm actually thinking that maybe over here, we can add, this will be like wooden, uh, things like wooden doors and fences and uh, like even like more chests and stuff like that. So it's like items that are made out of wood go in there. I'm actually thinking maybe on top, what if we did like this top one over here is diamond and then iron and then gold and then all the different types of like cool ores that we can find. Means I think have... that's cool. I like putting the diamonds on top because you know they're precious, yeah. they're valuable. That's but the I'm gold's thinking. over. The gold is already over here. Uh, we can just move those and change those to okay. something else. Maybe we turn that into. I'm not sure, but let's put the iron okay. into. There. You know what? I'm thinking, builder boy. Maybe, perhaps we should move the food near the furnaces. Ooh, that's a really good idea. I like that. Yeah, convenience is key. Yeah. Okay, let me see. Don't think 
So we do have some diamond somewhere. <laughs> uh, ooh. So right now that's enchanted books. We don't want that there. Let's put our shovel over there. Oh, I think it might be over here. Ah, yes, we've got lapis. And ooh, some more gold actually. Okay. This is good. And ooh, more iron. And that's about it. Okay, don't really have anything, unfortunately, for the diamond yet. We need to collect some diamonds. We sure do, builder boy. <laughs> Um, so Sorry, I'm just. <laughs> that's what I do when I get a little stir crazy. I just, I just start speaking in different accents. <laughs> Where do you think we should put the food? I think we should put the food next to the furnace. Next to right the here, right here in this little right thingamajig. Yeah, you right see? here. Okay. Uh, so let's get a portrait there and a portrait there. Let's get rid of that and put some more there. Think a chicken again in the in the item frame. For chicken sure. looks good. Looks mm. tasty. Yum yum yum. Maybe we shouldn't keep chicken on the outside. It makes me want to eat it all the time. <laughs> Alright. And I think we're gonna need a different space for stone as well. Cause we've got a lot of stone. I'm gonna take the coal and I'm gonna make a coal uh, portion as well, right beside the furnaces, because we need the coal to burn the furnaces. So let's put Great all the coal idea. in there. Great idea. I'm loving this color scheme organization because I'm a very visual person. And now this way I can just, you know, do it by color. That's so much easier for me. Right? I, I love think, that. I think it's looking really good so far. I think there's some stuff that we can do to really spruce it up a bit. Like get a couch and a TV. Uh, I, I'm thinking first we might want to add a little, uh, hmm. We're gonna have to do a little bit of uh, restructuring, but I think it'll be worth it. Um, Builder boy, how come, can zombies just walk down here? Uh, yes. Maybe we should make a door. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good idea. Let's, let's do that right now. Yeah, because not only could they get down there, but we would basically be trapping ourselves in. And let's see here. Where did that big uh, opening go that used to be inside of here? Uh, which big opening? Oh, it's, it's over there, actually. Where? Very cool. That uh, looks nice. I think it's actually over here. Oh, okay. <laughs> like somewhere over here. Oh, okay. And what we're actually going to be doing is at, at some point, what we want to do is make this into another entrance to go over there. So it's going to be like so. All right, no worries. I just... I felt like I was losing my mind again, <laughs> you know? Oh, can we put some plants near the front door? Oh, of course. I love yes. that idea. Nice little welcoming addition. Okay, so I'm making a little bit of a tunnel right here. Just trying to see where exactly the other ooh. big hole is. Oh, it's, ooh, okay. Well, this is the huge crevice, actually. And the other hole is just to the left here. So what we actually need to do is build to the left over here. And then that will take us right there. Awesome. And so this will be a, a, a cute little hallway. And then we should be good. I like that. That's cool. And then, and then this can lead to like a huge living room or bedroom or whatever we want to make it really. Really cool. I do want to have some secret chambers in here too so we can, you know, we can keep keep bad guys captive. I like that. Okay. I'm actually going to make this a little bit wider. And then that way we can put a door right in the middle. 
Uh, let's see. And the door like so. And, and thank, thank you, you so much. Oh, gorgeous. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty good. What? I don't think they're symmetric. Wait, are they? No, one's... Do they look even? Uh, even enough. Yeah. Yeah. I think they're just both to the left and to the right. Oops. Ah, it's there we go. so cool in here. I love it. So are we going to call this a storage unit for our loot, or is this also going to be... This is our home, right? Uh, so this is a portion of our home. <laughs> so are you telling me you want to be roommates for the time being that I'm in strawberry ice cream? I think so. Yeah? If that's okay with you. It's okay with me. In fact, I would feel a lot safer that way. I think we could help each other. I think that makes sense. I mean, I'm sure, as long as we both have our own bedrooms. <laughs> of course. You know, because... I'm going to want mine to look a little bit different than yours, I think. How come we have no windows in here? We're underground right now. Oh, yeah. But ups, <laughs> we're, once we build the top layer above, that will definitely have some windows. So no worries there. <gasps> oh, the sun's going down. Ugh. Are we gonna run home and sleep? Yes, let's do We've that. We've gotta, yes. Uh, time to go. Uh, should I shut this door or just leave it? Uh, yeah, shh. Whoops, sorry. Oops, uh, and ooh, that looks. I'm running home, Builder Boy, sorry. Better ah! safe than sorry. <laughs> I'm running too. Don't leave me. I'm sorry. Ah! There's your bed. Okay, time to go sleep. All right, good night, Builder Boy. <laughs> Good night, Psycho Girl. See you tomorrow. Ooh, that was fun. Finally. Who would have thought you could have so much fun with brown and wood? You know, there's lots of wood. I know we're not far along enough yet to introduce cool colors. And who would have thought that brown could look so nice? But it really does. I still can't wait to change it. I can live with it for now. Sometimes you just have to let people do what they do, you know? I'm more of a stone kind of gal. I like castles and blacks and whites and, you know, just things that aren't so much like dirt. I mean, don't get me wrong. I would love to go camping. I like nature. I like to get rough and tough and dirty. But in my home, I want it to be like sleek and, you know, kind of medieval and stuff. In time, all in due time. But Builder Boy has some pretty, uh, pretty nifty design skills, huh? Not bad for a boy. So, well, that was nice. That was a, a nice relaxing design organizing, you know, spring cleaning or end of summer cleaning type of day. I'm down for that once in a while because you know we're just prepping for the long journey ahead. We have so much work to do. I'm gonna get some rest right now. You keep doing you and I'll see you soon. Bye.